everybody, it's Dr. Nicole Friels here. I have a pretty unique ingrown toenail for you to see today. Um, it's only been here for three weeks. Did you bump it on anything or it just kind of started bothering you all of a sudden? I've had them for a while. Um, okay. I bought them in the other foot and uh -huh. got that removed. And then this one, I guess where I was like picking at my nail a lot, mm -hmm. and just pulled it off, it didn't mm -hmm. grow correctly. Okay, <laughs> so that's really good because picking your toenails, and I see this in kids all the time, really can create um, an ingrown toenail. So never ever pick your toenails. Always if you're having pain in there, it's best to um, have someone look at it to make sure that um, nail's not getting into the skin. So I wanted to show you here something called a pyogenic granuloma, which is basically this tuft of skin here. Right, all of that, this is grown and you can actually see pus underneath the nail right there. So the granuloma has developed because it's been here for quite some time and what it's trying to do is really protect the toe and kind of push that nail out. So what I'm gonna do is numb up the toe back here. We're gonna remove that little piece of nail, put some medicine on the root so it doesn't come back. Um, there's about a 5% chance it can. Uh, you'll soak it every day and sprinkle a little collagen wound powder in there to get it to heal. I'm also going to remove the tuft of skin, the granuloma, and put a different medicine on there called silver nitrate. What that's gonna do, it cauterizes it. So um, if you have any animals, like specifically dogs, and you're trimming their toenails and you get a little close and it kind of bleeds a little, the silver nitrate is what they use to um, stop the bleeding in that particular area. So basically the same thing. So the medication or the, um, the uh, silver nitrate is gonna allow that to retract back much quicker. So get back to a healthy looking toenail. Okay, so no allergies to numbing medicines. Let's go ahead and numb it up. I don't, you know, deep breaths for me. Take a big deep breath in. <laughs> Hold it for five seconds for me and then you'll let it out slowly. If you need me to stop, you let me know. Basically, I've got it right here. Absolutely. <laughs> I was going to do that big old voice. I'm sorry. Not, no worries at all. So just kind of um, try to relax. And like I said, if you need me to stop, just let me know. I'm just going to put your foot just like that. All right. Here we go. A little cold spray. Quick little sick. Now just keep in mind, this is the hard part. After this, you're not going to feel anything. Slowly inject your medicine less of a burn with that for your anesthetic how we doing up there good this is you're doing great okay let's get a little bit of top here good yeah deep breath for me five seconds hold it and then just slowly exhale you're doing great one more and we're done okay <laughs> You get to take it for your ball. <laughs> she was like, I want to see, and I was like, you are not see. That's so funny. We have um, lots of people that watch these. So we have a YouTube channel, which is where this will be. Yay. That, and it's great for education because they'll you can watch this and know exactly what to expect when you come in. All right, everybody, let's get started. Get that little nail out. So first, I'm just going to free up the nail. And there may be some pus that comes out. And you can see actually where the infection was tunneling here. What that's gonna do is lift up your nail and um, cause you to get fungus in long term. I know. Oops, sorry. Just let me know if I'm covering it. We got two videographers today. There you go. You can be a YouTube celebrity. Here we go. That's what we're getting out, guys. So, can you I see? Can okay. You don't watch it. You don't watch it the first time around, huh? Don't blame you. I don't think I watched it the first time. Okay. So that's nice and out. So let's go ahead and put the medicine on the root so it doesn't come back. That's it. Good. Yeah, I know. <laughs> The one I just did next door, the guy said the same thing. He's like, that's it. I'm like, sorry. Wow. Well, it's funny because I wear white pants um, here a lot. And people on the YouTube channel are like, 
what are you doing wearing yeah. white pants? I'm like, I'm not sure what you're expecting, but this isn't like a bloodbath or anything. I mean, you can see there wasn't even a drop of blood. I was like, yes, it's a bloodbath. <laughs> Carnage. Carnage. <laughs> oh my gosh. So any questions about how to take care of this after we are done today? And, all right, let's get, clean it up a little bit here. And then I'm gonna get, trim off the granuloma, which is that tuft of skin, so we can get you a pretty nail yes, right please. away. I'm so hard about saying. <laughs> tuft of skin here. So we can get back to normal. And these granulomas, they like to bleed. That's how it's growing. It's basically extra skin. Don't try this at home. <laughs> That's a very good, I should say that. <laughs> so this dead skin here is just going to slough off, okay? Maybe get a little bit more of it. Do you stand a lot at your job? Oh, a lot. Not a lot. Okay. I'm an activities assistant at a nursing home. Oh, wonderful. What so, nursing home? North Point. North Point. I'm trying to think. I used to go trim toenails. Trim Boulevard. I didn't go to that one. Okay, that's a nitrate. Now what we're gonna do is just get you wrapped up and you're all done. So try to, when you get home tonight, take it easy, kind of be a nice couch potato for me. <laughs> do you live with your parents? Yes, at the moment. At I the moment. I lived on my own for a while, but I just moved back in with them in May. Uh-huh, um, that's so nice. I take lived with a boyfriend. Ha. Never again. Oh no. <laughs> All right. A little extra Coban on here. All right, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, if you have this kind of granuloma or growth on your uh, next to your toenail, let us know. Snap a pic. I'd love to see what you've got going on. And I guess I'll see you next time. Don't forget, subscribe to the channel, like, comment, follow. I don't know. There's so many, you know, handles now. I don't know. So anyway, I'll see you.